Hello guys and welcome to The Impulsive Beauty. Today we will be going over my Marshall buys. Now, I was going to do a get ready with me and going over my Marshall buys, but it was gonna be a lengthy video because I wanted to go over my Marshall buys before the stores closed down, obviously. <laughs> um, but it was going to get real, real long. So I'm going to split them in two. We're gonna go over the stuff I got, you know, and it's gonna be mostly makeup and just like two skincare items. And then on another video, we're gonna go over, um, we're gonna get a full face of Marshall items with a get ready with me video. So let's go ahead and dive right in. So I wanted to do this video uh, with just makeup that I purchased at Marshalls. Of course, this is makeup that I purchased at Marshalls before all the stores closed down. I discovered that Marshalls sold good makeup, you know, like brand makeup, about two months ago. And oh boy, was that a mistake. I actually started going there about three to four times a week. Not just Marshalls, but also Ross as well as TJ Maxx. So today I kind of put together uh, the makeup I purchased at Marshall, uh, Marshalls. Not all of the makeup, but all the makeup that I could think I purchased at Marshalls. And I figure we could do a get ready with me because I kind of wanted to share what I bought as well as the makeup that didn't do so good and you know just some tips and just to do a get ready with me. So let's dive right in to this. I, one of the last things I purchased I did not start using yet. So let me go ahead with those. Uh, this right here is the cave, uh, Kevin Alcoin o right there. It's a really pretty uh, blush. I did not use it yet because I bought so many Too Faced uh, blushes. And this one was $7.99. I'm not really sure if you can see it. There you go. $7.99 and I will post all the prices either probably when I hold it up right there I will have it right there <clears throat> so this one cost me $7.99 and it's such a pretty blush and I've just started getting into blush Ooh. this is what this looks like and I really love peach because I normally have like as you can see I have a little pink, you know, kind of face. I get red all over and I just gravitate towards, you know, peach and just soft kind of colors for blush as well as, um, I don't know, I just love peach blushes. It's kind of weird. So that's one of the purchases I made. This is one of the last ones. Um, I remember I saw it, I saw this one, and I saw something else, and I was like, immediately I grabbed it, I, I looked to see if it was swatched, it wasn't. So that was cool that I got. Um, another thing that I got, not another thing, but like four that I grabbed are the Too Faced uh, Dual Blushes. I really love these. This one is the berry and bubbly and i did not know if i was gonna get this one uh it was ten dollars and they usually retail for 30. um i wasn't sure oh the smell so good i think that's what they get you um i wasn't sure if i was gonna get it because it was like too pink you know it's just like too pink um and like i said i'm already pink but it seemed a little bit soft, so I was like, let me try it. It's 10 bucks. I can get three at Marshalls for the price of one at Ulta or at Sephora. 
actually don't even think they have these at Sephora. This one is like my melons. It's also $10. And you can find these at Marshalls as well as TJ Maxx. There we go. That's the word I was looking for. And again, this one was 10 bucks. I really I like this one. It's my second favorite out of the blushes. Uh, this one is my favorite, which is Papaya Pop. I absolutely love this one, which we'll be using today for sure. Uh, again, 10 bucks. Now, when I go to Marshalls or, you know, anywhere, I make sure that when I open these, I make sure that they're not swatched. You know, people love to put their fingers in these things. So you gotta make sure that they're not touched. Uh, this one's Pineapple Sun. And this one is called a strobing, uh, strobing bronzer. I can't even say that word. <laughs> a lot of bees. And this one is a bronzer. Obviously, you have the highlight right there. You can see it right there. And I really like this one because you get the bronzer, the highlight all together. It's just lazy but easy work, you know? It's just when you, you just want to go like really quick get some color. I really like this one too. If I don't want any pink and on my face, I put that one on. And again, when I go to Marshalls, I already know what I like. I already know what I'm looking for. I actually go there with things in mind. I already know, I, okay, I like Too Faced. I like, you know, I like Bite. I like the brand you know, like this brand and this brand. So when I go there, I start looking around and I go there quite often. So it's not like I went there and I got all of those things at once. I go there and I go there every other day to see what's new. And not only that, they could have been all, all there that same day, but they could have all been swatched. I've been to stores I went to one store in particular where I went there to one store, this this one store, and I did not want to buy absolutely anything in that store. Everyone in that store at the makeup section was just swatching, literally trying all their makeup on their lips. It was like so gross. So when I go there, I make sure that, you know, this hasn't happened to the makeup I'm going to buy. And if I'm not gonna buy the makeup, I don't even open it. So I know that I've been looking for this, you know, I will go and open it just to make sure that it hasn't been swatched. I don't swatch it either at the store. If it hasn't been touched, I don't even touch it. I just bring it home with me. But anyway, another thing that I got there was, and I haven't even opened it, um, this one, which is called Sweetie Pie. And it's supposed to be a bronzer. It is, it was. Uh, ten ninety nine, and I believe this one is like thirty bucks again. And it is, oh, it's really cute packaging right there. I'm assuming I opened it at the store to see if it was swatched. Now I'm like concerned because I don't remember the packaging. It might have might have been the last thing that I purchased. And that's what it looks like. It is really pretty. I guess it's supposed to be again all in one. Just a little bit of everything. Too Faced seems to really love um, shimmer. <laughs> There's shimmer on everything, on every bronzer. Um, not every bronzer, because I know they, I know they have one um, that there isn't, but in most of their stuff is like really, really shimmery. I really like shimmer anyway. Um, this is one of the first things I bought from them. You're so jelly. And this is the color Gilded Champagne. It costs 10 bucks right there. I have not used it, um, to tell you the truth. Um, I did see a review of someone touching it and it looked like, je like literally like jelly. So I was like, okay, I'm cool. I know that when I want that substance on my face, I will put my hands on it. I'm really weird about putting my hands and stuff 
But hey, I got a YouTube channel now. Maybe I should start. But there we go. Let's, hey, there's some on the cap. Let's do that. See right there? Ooh. Okay. Maybe let me put some in here. You can see it is, it's pretty nice. And of course, it smells delicious. Everything from Too Faced just smells so good. All right, so this is a lot of the Too Faced stuff. I mean, you're like, okay, it's not my last one. I thought this was the last one from Too Faced, but it's not. Let me get the last one. Uh, this is the absolute last thing I got from Too Faced. I know, because I remember when I went to the store, everyone in there was wearing gloves. So I remember now this was the last thing I purchased. $12.99. $12.99. Believe me, it was $12.99, even though the camera doesn't want to focus. It says $12.99. It's the Hangover Peach Extract one, the Hangover uh, Setting Spray. And they only had two, and I put two in my bag. Like, I need more setting sprays, you know? But then I was like, I'm, like, I'm crazy. I'm just going to leave the, the other one there, and I just got this one so okay now those are all my Too Faced ones then I purchased let's see other things that I've got from, that you can get this uh, Milani as you can there is there is a theme here I just got into blush and bronzers and highlighters I actually did not wear makeup for about three years. I quit makeup altogether. Um, during those three years, I come back um, and now highlighter is such a big thing. And I really like it. So I really like this combo. And this Milani one, it is this, the one called Sunlight. And it was only $2.99. Milani is such an affordable product anyway, but they were sealed. They had all three colors that, you know, and this was the lighter one. So I picked this one up. I did use it. You mostly see the bronzer one. Uh, you don't really see the blush that much. So you can probably use a smaller brush to be able to get, you know, the other colors if you really want more of the other colors. That'd probably be a good thing. Let's go on to the next one. Uh, this one, they have a crap ton of, a lot of these. Um, well, at least at the Marshalls I go to. I go to a lot of Marshalls. Okay, so I got so excited about my newfound uh, hobby of going to Marshalls. So then one day I told my sister, hey, um, do you know the Marshalls and TJ Maxx sells like brand makeup at, you know, TJ Maxx and Marshalls? She's like, yeah, I kind of know about that. I'm like, bitch, what didn't you tell me? And, you know, I'm here paying full price for these things. And I understand they don't have everything and it's just whatever they have there, you know? Um, so it's not like you're going to find everything you want, but it's still kind of cool, kind of like a surprise box, you know? Um, but I told her, how about we hit like three or four stores this Sunday? So we went to like different Marshalls and different TJ Maxx's. And it's kind of cool to go and discover what, you know, different stores have, what, um, how the stores are arranged. So now I know which stores to go to and which ones I do not go to. And I live in the Tampa Bay area. And there's one store I would definitely not go to. And there's a couple stores that are okay. But I definitely seen some stores on YouTube that I'm like, oh my God, I want to live there. I would be buying everything. I have not opened these, the Stilla. So these are glitter, uh, like glitter eyeshadow. This one is Golden Eye, Bronze Girl, and Rockin' Rose. Now, this one was $12.99 for these three. And they did have a cheaper uh, set that was, I believe, $10 for three. But 
And they had more of those than they did of this one. And this one's called I Spy. This is the I Spy um, collection. The other one I do not recall. I did not get it um, because I have so many of the Too Faced ones. But the other one was a little bit cheaper. But I like the color ones on this one better than the other ones. So if you really like Stella and or you want to try the eye glitter. I really like the eye glitter from Too Faced. But I heard that Stella is better. If not just as good as the Too Faced. So I had to get it. I will put I will put how much these actually cost. I'm assuming because they are in a little package, maybe they're not sold in stores anymore. Another thing that I did get is this Bite Prismatic Multi Stick. So I'm assuming you can use it as a skull pink pearl. That's the actual color. I'm assuming you can use this as a lipstick, as a a pretty pink it's supposed to be like a little bit a little bit of shimmer on it do you guys want me to swatch this i can swatch this i don't know if you are gonna be able to tell the swatch because this is very very faint oh there we go there you go right boop, boop right here it's very pretty um it will be a very light pink color if you use it as a lipstick or you can use it as a very light um as a very light or you can probably build it out because the first one didn't go as as um as shimmery but then the second one it actually went on and it doesn't feel it doesn't feel like I have anything on my on my hand as, unless I touch it but you can probably just set it uh this one's pretty cute and this was only five bucks I will post I will post how much it actually retails for. Now I did get I never done my eyebrows. Oh my god, there's another Too Faced thing. I did not see it because it was behind us. Um oh, Alright, okay, let me get let, let me They have so many Too Faced things there. I'm sorry. I know the brand, I know that they're cruelty free. And so, of course, I got it. This one, I actually did put it on. Um, this blue, it's called Unicorn Tear, Unicorn Tears. And it looks blue, but once you put it on your lips, it turns like pink with like blue sparkles. It's really pretty. I like it. Um, some people might not like it because, you know, not everyone really likes pink glittery lips. I like glitter. I'm pretty sure I said that on my first video. Um, okay, so <clears throat> what I was gonna say was that I never done my eyebrows. Like, I never put anything on my eyebrows. So I bought this uh, Wonder Brow thing and it came with a little spoolie thingy right here. Now, I tried to get this done. I think it was like, seven bucks right i try to put this on and i don't think it does anything or maybe i'm not doing it right because i've never done this in my life it came with the instructions but i probably mentioned this more than once i never read instructions i'm pretty terrible at it i just wing it i always wing everything usually i figure out life winging things but apparently i could not wing this one so um, I don't know. I will be putting this on on this get ready with me because we're gonna be using a couple things and apparently I think I'm going too slow because I still have a couple more other things and I still got to do my makeup. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. Okay, so yes eyebrows. All right, I did get <clears throat> This this is rose water and glycerine supposed to refresh you actually I'm gonna spray my face with it right now I was like I don't understand why people love these things and I wasn't gonna pay like a shit ton of money for it for just water so I was like let me see what the fuck is going on with this it was seven bucks damn I did pay seven bucks for it so it is more than anyway I don't know what I was thinking um but it's supposed to help you with dryness, and I do have dry skin. 
Um, I believe that I don't even have an oily T-zone. I have a nose oily T-zone going on. Just the nose. My nose is oily, does it? Other things I got. Okay, that rose water right here, I believe it, it retails for 10 bucks. So I think I'd save like three or two dollars. This right here, I will post how much it is, but I bought it for 13 or 14 dollars because um, it's, um, it's retinol from Strip Victim. And I just started messing around with retinol and I haven't tried this one. So it's still in the box. And I will post how much it is. I haven't tried it. This right here. It is, sorry, let me, if I get closer, it's because it's like so, you can never read this because it's got this um, reflective light and obviously it's, it's called Ageless Genius. There we go. Ageless Genius. It's, to, it's just a neck cream that is supposed to help with wrinkles. Man, we're all gonna get there. But if I can help it, I will. Um, this one right here was 10 bucks. If you go to Bare Minerals, which is uh, what this is from, it's 90 something dollars. Plus taxes is 100. It was 10 bucks. I said, hey, why not? I help my neck. These right here, NARS uh, lipstick, this one and uh, this one. I know they look very similar, guys, um, but I had to have both. This color is Roseland, Roseland and Bound. There we go. We're going to use one of these. Um, now, NARS, when I bought these, and like I said, I was out of makeup for about three years. I did not know that they were not cruelty free anymore. Um, because when I was doing my makeup three years ago, they were still cruelty free. And I just found out last week that they're not. So that kind of sucks. So yeah. Um, anyway, I did buy three... Uh, yeah, three foundations. This one's Becca right here and it's in the shade Ivory. You cannot see it because it won't focus. It's Ivory, believe me. Um, I actually, okay, so this is funny. I actually, I would have TJ, Mar TJ Maxx or Marshalls near an Ulta, right? Or I would go to Ulta before I would go to Marshalls and I will swatch <laughs> I will swatch everything I could there and I will find the correct, you know, match for my skin on, um, you know, on Becca, on, uh, they also sell NARS at TJ Maxx or Marshalls. So I will go and get my correct, um, you know, shade for my skin and then I would go to Marshalls or TJ Maxx and buy the foundation. Um, so it's kind of funny because I really do not like to open the product and ruin it for someone else. So I would go to Ulta and Sephora and just be swatching there because they have, you know, they, they do have testers and you do not have testers at, you know, TJ Maxx or Marshalls. So I would just do that and then go to Marshalls and buy it. I know it's kind of crappy that I did that. Although they have testers. I do buy crap at Sephora and Ulta actually I buy too much stuff as, I, as you guys will be seeing in my next videos. Um, but this one was only 10 bucks and it retails for like 30 something. I probably put the, the price right next to it. This one I will be using today and you got, and I will tell you why it was only $3 the reason why I bought it. Okay. So this one is pure. Oh, you can freaking see it. Why does my camera not there? Bearer all and it's in light. I will use it today. It cost me three bucks and you guys will know why. <laughs> um, this one's another Becca and this is the Skin Love. I had not used this one and I did get it on the wrong shade. Yeah, it's cashmere. Cashmere, I believe is my uh, summer shade. So, you know, 
maybe I will tan a, a bit more and that'll be my right shade then. Uh, I, I got a couple more things. We have Bare Minerals. I love Bare Minerals uh, and I got matte just because this was one of the last things I got. I wish I had the original, but I am color fair. And <laughs> the first time I went there, they had a million of the fair colors in the original. I said, oh, okay, I'll come back and get it later. I went back later, didn't have it. So I got matte. It was only six bucks. And you guys know this is like $30. So yeah, they have these at Marshalls. And they are locked. Um, usually they have tape over it. I already opened it. Um, if you open it, just make sure that that lid is closed just like this. I haven't even opened it. Just make sure that your makeup is closed. That is such an important thing. Um, so your makeup doesn't, you know, dry up or it lasts you a while. Then I got this highlighting palette from Ellen Tracy. It was only $3 and I'm glad it was only $3 because it sucks. Do not buy it if you see it unless um, you want your highlighter to last three seconds. It sucks. We'll use it today. Um, I did buy two brushes and I really love these brushes. Um, this one is the Japanese uh, brush right here and I love just, you know, just using it for any kind of uh, Too Faced dual blushes. And this one, I the fan brush, I do use for, you know, a highlight right there. And they work really good. I really love them. This became a really, really long video. So what I will do is a get ready with this, um, makeup on another video right after this one because it is already 25 minutes in and I understand if you guys don't want to see a whole 45 minute video. So this is the, so this became a U-Haul video, a U-Haul. I keep calling it a U-Haul, man. I don't understand why I keep thinking about maybe I should move that from the house. I should not move. Maybe that's why. A whole video. This is a whole video from Marshalls. There we go. That's what this is. Um, now, my my channel is about everything from beauty. Haul videos. Get ready with me. We're going to be doing giveaways. We're going to be doing reviews. So if you like, subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. It's so important to do so because I will be releasing quite a bit of videos and if you don't hit it, you won't be notified. So I will be seeing you right after this video. Bye guys. Going through my Marshalls buys. Oh fuck. <laughs> I forgot what I was doing. Okay. Start over. Welcome guys. I am too energetic today. Let me have some water. Okay. Welcome guys. Oh, that was too loud. <laughs> All right, mellow out, mellow out. I'm getting red. Welcome guys and Hello guys, that's what I meant to say. That's why it was sounding so weird. Oh my God. All right, got it.